Hello everybody, how are we doing? I am checking audio levels. Things look good. Can you hear me? Good evening everyone. I'm going to try and go through the list here. Michelob, 5th Gen Farms, Eric the Crazy Viking, Phelandea, Zach, Niels, uh, Eric Larson, how are you doing? Dean, uh, Jared Dooley, uh, Cranky, good evening sir, how are you doing? Zach, Alex, Musketeer, Ozzy, Raiden, Jan, Scott, Free for All, uh, Ozzy, Eric, I've said hello to you already. Scoop Steve, how are you doing? Farmer Ed, nice to see you. Jeremy. Now I'm starting to get pop pop. I see you there. Mally, Niels, Sean, John Deere, 440, FS Crofter, Ginger Ninja, Jeremy Freeman. How are we doing? Hope everyone's doing well. Welcome to the stream. We'll try and keep up with the chat. As it goes through, how's everybody doing this week? Are you enjoying the Kubota pack? I have to say a big thank you, actually, to everyone who has used my code, uh, either for FS22 when it came out, any of the DLCs that have come out, because I've just made Giant Silver Partner, which is very nice. So thank you very much. I owe you all for that. That is much appreciated. So the support means a lot. Means a lot. Um... I am enjoying the Kubota pack. I can see in the chat there. I am really enjoying the Kubota pack, actually. Um, more than I thought I would. Um, there's some really nice... Uh, there's some really nice models in it, actually. That The M8 tractor, I think, is gorgeous. Yeah, a little bit underpowered. Might have to go to the XML and bump it up by maybe another 20 horsepower. Um, but, uh, yes, Kubota pack is good. Now, here's a question. Anybody in the chat who hasn't got it yet... Um, Hands up if you haven't got it yet. Because it might be a lucky night. Um, also, you see this? See this? Can't see it behind my mic. That way. Freebies from the Highland Show. Because the guy on the crone stand, son played Farm Sim. Not bad, eh? So, Emil's doesn't have it. Oh, good. There's a few of you. Good. I don't have only a second version. Gee, all right. Weird flex there from Jeremy, but uh, still acceptable. Well, good news, guys. I'm going to give a couple of copies away tonight. We'll do one after an hour, and we'll do one at the end of the night. So, there you go. John Deere 440. You don't have it, but you don't have FS22. That's a shame. Remember that on that point. It is a. Uh, it will be a PC version. I can't do. Uh, I can't do uh, PlayStation and Xbox, unfortunately. But I can actually gift Xbox. So if you've got an Xbox, we could maybe do that. PlayStation's the one that is a real pain. So we are going to do some combining. We've got some fields sorted. So I've got my favourite combine out. First time I've had this out for a while. I love this combine. So we thought we'd use this one tonight. We've got a couple of these. Kevin, did, you didn't even notice that. Kevin, where have you been? Literally every YouTuber <laughs> for Farm Sim has, has talked about nothing else but Kubota. It, apart from the giveaways, this is a Kubota-free zone tonight. There you go. So, uh... You can rest easy that you're not going to see too much orange tonight. So what we'll do, we're going to set these two combines up. We're going to set up, we're going to, we're going to do that dangerous thing and set up course play and auto drive live. We're going to have a, uh, a truck to unload back at the grain silo. Um, see, I disagree, pop, I disagree, pop pops too new. It's too new. You need to have the 760 or the 770, which are age appropriate. I'm kind of hoping that's what Sid's doing. This has only ever been in green. Arm oh, Sim Snowy, nice to see you. Right, um, so yes, as I was saying. I know, Scott, right? Why do I do it to myself? Talk about 
It's like setting myself up for a fall. Honestly, Argzy will have... Argzilla's ears will be burning over there in New Zealand. He'll be logging on as we speak. Now he's heard the fact that I'm going to try and do some cosplay and auto drive live. So, and Ed will be crying into his... Uh, Ed will be crying into his um, auto drive courses. As he knows, I'm going to butcher his auto drive course a little bit more. Thank you, Jeremy. Much appreciated. You are a gent, as always. Very, very grateful for that. And if you had not seen my my uh, posts as well this week, I'm all booked up for FarmCon. I am all booked up to go uh, over to uh, Mannheim, over to Frankfurt. Fly over to Frankfurt and then about an hour away. Well, half an hour, I think, on the train from Frankfurt to Mannheim. Got a hotel... A mere 10 minute walk from the venue, so uh, should be good. Already spoke to Virtual Farmer and DJ this week. Looking forward to uh, catching up with them when we're over there. So I love this header as well. It's the first time I'd use this. This is the in-game one for class. It's quite cool, isn't it? Right. Um, now... I want to utilize this space for... I want to utilize this space for uh, where I put my truck. So I'm going to actually move these onto the field a little bit. And we're going to go clockwise with these. I'm going to try lands as well, so we've always got our uh, pipes in the appropriate position. Now if you remember with this... Um, map. The last few times we've done this, we've had to uh... Oh, better unfold it first. We've had to... Uh... Oh, come on! Pay attention, FSG. Um, we've had to run a little course around the outside of the field to help the help the trucks get out of the field, but we'll try it without first. How are my German language skills? Um, basic at best. I can ask for a beer. Well, what else do you need? Right, let's just clear a little bit of space out here. There we go. Remember, I don't like the first headland. Always causes you grief. Oh, there's a bit of dusty lands. Look at that. I've got it set to two. We've got it set to a ratio of two at the moment. We will look at that in a bit more detail in a little bit. But uh, let's just move second combine in as well. Get him into space. There we go. Yes, we will. Uh, we will talk about Dusty Lands in a little bit because I love it. It is authentic as authentic can be. Yes. Hey, Farm Sim Game. So, if you didn't know, guys, Farm Sim Game are the guys that have developed Dusty Land, and it is uh, Dusty Lands plural. And I think it's. I think it's fantastic. I really do. So, uh, thank you, guys. Um, is, is there a team behind it, actually? I, I haven't actually asked you guys about it. I, I take it it's more than one person, or have you got... Is it the work of one genius? Yes, among some other very cool mods as well. And not to mention all the brilliant stuff you do with the Discord bots for uh, servers and things like that as well. Really doing some massive value-add stuff for Farm Sim at the moment. So if you don't follow them on Facebook and... All of that jazz, get following them, because they are a stand-up gang of folk. Jamie, how are you doing? Welcome, and congrats for seven months, mate. That's good to see. Right, we've got two trailers here, but we're just going to take one, I think. Now, we've got this challenge as well. I haven't tried dual hopper trailers much in FS22. I know it was an issue with course play and auto drive in 9... Team. 
So I am intrigued to see if I will fill both hoppers with this, but we will find out. Jared, five months as well. Congratulations, mate. Oh, there's the old game save, I think. Troy, if you do exclamation mark map, um, you will you will be able to download it. It is a uh, it's been out for a very long time. Well, it's all relative. Quite a long time for FS22. Saran, how are you doing? Tobo, nice to see you. Legion, hello mate, nice to see you. So you sneaking in there. Devon County Show tomorrow. I might be going to a local show on Saturday, actually, the Haddington Show. If there's any super locals here. Nachos, very nice. Right, so what we'll do here, we will turn on auto drive course and just work out where we're going. That is our route in here, so I'm going to run beyond field 27 here, because I want a load point. So I'm going to about, I would say, here, kick off a new little record, new to there. Um, yep, yeah, okay, I'm happy with that. Let's call that field 27 load. This is the problem now, I can't read the chat because I'm too busy. Uh... Did I see Mark was in there? And then I'm going to go... Oh, there he is. Hello, Mark Thor. See if I can make this turn without going into the field too hard. Might have to just graze the crop slightly. There we go. Now we're only going to go with, what I think, one trailer and one auger wagon here tonight. Just because. I just need to hook that up to there and that up to there. And we will do... This we will load at field 27, load, we will unload at, shrink some of these down, um, now I can't remember which one is my, <laughs> I always do this, Fair Oaks, Fair Oaks grain dryer, and we are unloading the majesty that is corn. So let us obviously turn off record and let that run while we go and get a tractor. I think so, Scott. Um, especially I've got the Demco, so... Now, why is he going that way? Why did he not... Um Is it because he's um, they're sending him to the field, right? I want you. Let's just encourage him to go this way, shall we? Ah, yes, because he was. Um, let's do that. Okay, right. right. We might as well ride back to the farm with him now. Yeah. It's going to send me a big fuel bill just for doing a lap. I'm catching up on the chat already. You got the John Deere 4940 mod. I can't seem to get it filled. Any tips? Uh, is it out? Did it come out today? I don't think it's out yet, is it? 49.40? Can we check a fence, shall we? These seem to work well under auto-drive conditions. 
So he's in there. He'll probably just roll back now. Yep, that's what I wanted him to do. If he can get round this bend with no interruptions. That was tight. You never get tired of the old LSWs on this fen, do you? Yeah, if, if you don't know which tractor this is, guys, this is the custom modding Fent available in the Mod Hub. It's a glorious tractor. So I've gone for the slightly smaller Demco wagon. And I haven't put the tracks on it, I've kept the tyres on it because I quite like the big tyres. Uh, Jeremy, is there a, if you hit exclamation uh, auto drive. You'll get a link to uh, Farmer Ed's brilliant auto drive course for this map. How long have we been playing this? I checked today. It was 50 hours on this map, all live streamed. And uh, I don't think we've had a single auto drive error at all, have we? Other than user error, which is me. That's user error, not loser error. There we go. Guido, the map Renaboot is very good. It certainly is. It certainly is. Got the... Uh, oh, that's the wrong button. We've got the electric tarp on this as well. Now. Unloading. Have I made a hash of this already? Let's just turn on auto drive again. I've not so much made a hash of this as I've um, just got my header trailers in the way a little bit, I think. So I might, what I might do, what might I do, what might I do, folks? I think I might. No, do you know what? I'm going to just move those header trailers. Let's make it easy for ourselves. Music Man, how's it going, mate? Any issues with the new patch? FPS? Um, no, the only thing that uh, has happened is your shader re uh, cache has reset, so if you're logging into games, it's a bit stuttery to start with. You just need to uh, run the game for a little bit and let your shader cache update itself. And you should be good after that. There's one. No one loading tarp slide. <laughs> First rule of unloading club, don't unload tarp side. There we go. They're out of the way. Now what I want to avoid doing here is having the tractor and the uh, trailer clash. So if the trailer's full and the, let's say, I mean, it might not happen, the likelihood of it happens is slim. But let's say we've got the Demco arriving. In fact, maybe it's the right thing to do, is it? To uh, have it unload on the tarp side. Um. What I don't want to do is cross the streams. If you excuse the uh, the Ghostbusters analogy. So what I think I want to do is so we, he's got to be connected to an auto drive course, right? So we need to almost pull him from behind the from behind the truck, spin him round, and almost you want your unload point here somewhere. Or, well, about here, probably. And then he'll reach the first um, hopper, unload that, and then roll to the second hopper. So, uh... But the only problem with that is, you've got, um... That issue, if he's arriving as the truck's... Do you know what? We're just going to have to, uh... We're just going to have to roll with the punches, aren't we? Let's see what happens. So... 
will do. Right, we'll go back a little bit further so we don't clatter into the back of that trailer potentially. Let's do somewhere about here. Okay, record. Let's connect that. Actually. No, we are going to do it this way. I had second thoughts then, but I'm going to do it this way. I'm going to go a little bit further along here into this wider open space to turn around. Hope he doesn't end up in the river at any point. And we're going to take a nice long run up. And skim over the cab. And we can do that. Now, how does Ed's loop work there? Let's even go a bit further, shall we? No, that one's alright, actually. That one's alright, okay. Um, we'll call that Field 27 Auger Unload. And then we want to do that but we also want to do we also want to do that so he doesn't have to drive around the map to get back to his waypoint so he'll just loop around then right I think that might be us that was a uh, That was traumatic. <laughs> I'm, I am watching the uh, the Wyoming chat. It's um, yes. It's how, how do I say it? it's it's. I thought I would uh, have got more of it done than I have while I've been off. Um, I've just been a bit lazy with it. If I'm being honest. Um. So this needs to be on Combine. Our waypoint is Field 27 Auger Unload. No, it isn't. Um, so, no, our waypoint's just going to be Field... Nah, let's put a waypoint in. Let's give that, let's call that a wait point. Field 27, wait. That's what we needed. So, field 27, wait. And unload at field 27, org unload. Right. Jonathan White, how did you bend the path between the two points? Do you like that? You should go and check out my auto drive tutorial. So, basically, you before you click on the second so uh, if you've got this one here say there's no um, in fact I should be able to do this shouldn't I so if, if you break your link so if you're connecting two points up you click on your first link before you click on your second point so just mouse over it like that and then you do your, your scroll wheel it will move it doesn't show it there unfortunately um, because it's not on a bend um, hang on let's just move that over there so if you click on your first link and then your second one and then just use your mouse scroll wheel he says as it now doesn't work typically that's annoying <laughs> you do you strangely it doesn't work now but anyway mouse scroll wheel ignore the fact that i'm not able to do it Right, turn it off. Let's see what happens here. Let's see if we've set all this up correctly. Ed's been very quiet, sweating away there. 
Hover over the second point, scroll down with your mouse. Yeah, I tried that. It's the first time it's never happened. Art curved to a single point. There you go. Now you broke it. There you go. Uh, Old Iron's back tomorrow, Crofter. Recorded it today. There you go. You can't do a single note. It's got to be part of a of eight. Of course, no harvester with the same target found. Right, he's going to go to auger unload. Just do a little bit of test. So what we need to do now is we need to set our two combines to field 27 weight. We'll do that at the very end after we've kicked them off. Waylon, how's it going, mate? Nice to see you. <laughs> do as I say. Exactly, Trey. Ain't that the truth. Ain't that the truth. Musketeer, zero, zero, 009. No, not at all, mate. Not at all. And the next time I come to it, we'll be laughing. We will be laughing, right? Let's just... What are you going to do? Yeah, he's going back to wait because nothing happening. Hey, Mills, have we heard about anybody making a Japanese Mac? Well, no, we have not, actually. And there we go. Our loot works as well. There you go, Ed, hi me. Don't, don't. Espen, how's it going? Nice to see you. Right. That is doing its thing. Hopefully we've got no collisions on. Right, let's see what we can do here. Or see what, let's see what we can break here now, shall we? Um, so we don't need to see him anymore. For this little bit, all we need to do is... Like I've not done dual machines for a while. This could be fun. Create job. Force play field work. Open course generator. Multiple tools. Two headlands, that's four, so that's right. We'll start in the headlands. Um oh, automatic. Rose per land. Center mode. Let's try lands. I Never use lands. So this could be fun. Let's have a look. Other than a very bizarre line across the field there. It looks like it potentially could work. Um, I did select multiple tools. So um, I want to save that. Save course, activate field 27, combines X2, combines, there you go. Changing the way it's spelt. Combines times two. Go back. Now I need to open this. That's our left combine, that's correct. Um, I'm just going to hit the go button there. Oh, first waypoint's always a good one. The nearest point was the first waypoint then. And then we'll jump in here. We will load this, that's first waypoint that. Load the course. Load the course. Activate the course. Go back. First waypoint. Turn those off. This is the right combine. Turn him on. And there you go. I have the dust mod on medium, actually. So look, I like the fact it throws dust out of the um, header as well as the back. So there you go. This is dusty lands on two times, on 2x. And you can go up to... Uh, to uh, three. Set auto drive waypoints for the combines. Where do I do that, Scott? Oh.
Yes. I was gonna I was gonna get I hadn't forgotten. Uh so we are Field 27 weight, aren't we? Yes. And field 27 weight. There we go. Right. Now we're going. Let's have a look at Dusty Lands. So this is on uh, 2x. So let's just jump down. So it's shift and... Uh, the comma and the period or minus key uh, period or full stop key big button um, so if you press shift and comma that takes it down to one now actually I believe uh, FSG guys said that around about uh, 0.5 is equivalent to the in-game dust um, so we want to bump it up to one as you would be about double what you would see in the game um, and then if you go up to and if you see it's adjusting on both the combines so it's a universal setting so if we go up to two I think two looks quite good I think it varies from machine as well some machines are a little bit more erratic than others so there's two and there is three. I mean, three isn't even that bad. I've seen dustier combines than that. You can barely see the second one. How good, I mean, how good does that look? Let's turn the HUD off. Oh. He's put his pipe out for some reason. Don't put your pipe out, mate. That's the last thing we need. Clattering that off trees. Please don't hit the tree. Why is your pipe out? Uh, Dusty Lands does work on multiple I see what the I'm gonna swear now I'm gonna have to stop everything because he decided he wanted to put his pipe out I mean literally who asked him to do that now the other dude's gonna crash into us hopefully he'll stop and wait no You've got to love it, haven't you? <laughs> you can see the other one is too much dust. Brilliant. Uh oh dear. Look at that, look at the dust off the tractor as well. I mean You've got you've you've got to laugh or you'd cry, right? So last waypoint, nearest waypoint. I always say this with um with the head the headlands, it's always the worst. Headlands is always the worst. Let's knock it down a bit. I actually like it at three. But it does bring other challenges with it. Also, I don't know why he's driven on. Oh, I do. They're at 70% already. Do I have stop to unload on? No. No, I think it's... Uh, it's because it's ready. I think we've got the set. In fact, I'll just check that. Um, let's check our auto drive settings. We don't want him to unload at eighty-five percent. Ideally, we want the pre-call level is sixty. Unload fill level. Let's unload him at ninety-five, um, and then go back to the other dude. Let's set him the same. My only issue here is the tractor might have to drive into the crop to. Uh, to unload like I said it's a, it's a minor issue until um, you get this first headland out of the way it's always a challenge with the first headland so there you go combine 2 is about to cut in now he's on 95% he should cut in now and let the the Demco come in now my only fear is he's going to crash into the other combine he keeps reversing Oh, that was close, wasn't it? Yeah, pre-called down at 60. I saw that cranks. So that's, uh... that's pretty 
free call at what 80 both full now all right which way it's gonna the lottery of who he decides to go to first the fent is usually quite good hey scorpion from mexico how you doing mate hope holiday's good there we go. And we've also got to watch the challenge of uh, the fent getting out of the way before uh, the combine moves away as well. Evening Pleasant, how's it going? Nice to see you. Love it. The equipment does not get dirtier faster with the mod. I don't think so, Trevor. No. Um, there we go. Now, is he going to get to the second combine, which is buried in a tree? I think we might need to help him a bit with that. Yeah, let's just help him a bit here. To manually let him run on a little bit. There's a gap in the trees. Let's try this. <laughs> no, it's a disaster. Is he going to be able to sneak past that tree? No, he's going to cut in now. That's good. Because he is full. Are you going to keep going? Yeah. They reversed a lot further in... Um, in FS19. They didn't reverse back as far. They just cut in. So, in fact, I will go back a little bit further as well. I've just got to be quick when I reverse. Yeah, I usually find this first set, especially if you've got a tree line around the edge of your field. You've got big open fields, it's not an issue, but if you've got a tree line, it always kind of throws you a little bit. Belan, dare take care, man. Do not believe in cell coverage. All the best, mate. Thanks for hanging out. Nick Del Piore, how are you mate? Nice to see you, it's been a while. So look at that, we've got 70% and we should maybe just about squeeze... Um, well, not even close are we, we're going to get two, uh, two combines in this and then he's going to have to disappear. So we might set that unload to... Uh, 80% or something like that. So he's not loading up with like 5% of a trailer and then having to... Uh... He's waiting for a call now. Am I allowed to stream from FarmCon? Uh, I assume so, Jeremy. Um, I'm certainly taking all my kit with me. All my video stuff. Sprue and Glue, nice to see you. How are you doing? Clipping through the uh, tarp still on that. That's a little bit frustrating. Right, we've got a bit of gap between our uh, combines now. He should not be the first lead combine. Shows you how much trouble we got him with that second combine. Chunky Tanker, did I find a McHale Baylor? I saw there are two, but they are unofficial um, updates to um i think ones that were out in fs17 or maybe 19 i can't find that they are legit or permissions been asked for them which is a shame uh so if anybody knows different let me know but um but yeah it was nice to see that mchale's been in the game because it was a it was a nice stand had some nice nice stuff on it actually so um that's what i might do ed 
Or, if it ain't broken, don't fix it. But I think you might be right. I think I might just pause this. I'll probably crash into him on the way past. And knock him out of kilter. There we go. Mr. Junt, how are you? Did it do that on 19? I must never have filled them right up. <laughs> did I try King? Yes, I did, Chunky, and I did a bit of research behind it, and it isn't... Um, the, the modders they have listed on King mods have no reference to them at all on their Facebook pages and things like that. Smoky TV with the gifted subs. What a gentleman. What a guy. Thank you so much, mate. That's brilliant. There you go. Enjoy your new memberships, folks. That gives you access to the multiplayer servers as well. So if you want to jump on um, on the Discord, you can play with the other guys. Here he comes, smoking away in the background. Anybody would think he was on fire. Robo sock, watching me like a hawk. Good call, man. I'm going to be busy on Discord later. I really am, aren't I? Junt, did I ever drive 4,000 miles in 10 days? I have not, mate. No, you were... Uh, how was your massive road trip? Was it all right? Mr. T-Man as well. How you doing, mate? Nice to see you. Hope you're all good. As long as you've ticked the box to say you will accept the memberships. I think I have. I'll double check. There we go. Coming through. Why is that pipe going out there? Is it is it picking up the um is it picking up the hopper of this combine? I wonder if we actually bump our convoy distance up. go right up four oh two think all we need to do now don't need to turn convoy on do we now in twenty two Convoy distance is all we need, isn't it? We have to do it on both combines still. So this one, convoy distance will be 246 still, so let's bump that up to... Farmer Tech, how are you doing mate? Nice to see you. Ah, is it the 80%? Save that. Save those settings. Good evening, Mark. How are you doing? So that's him at 86. Got tractor moving. Yeah, look at that. Look at that. Right, let's go back to our... Right, you can... Go now. Nearest waypoint. Get on with it, man. Aaron B. Just found my channel today. So far, I really like it. Also joined the Discord. Brilliant. Oh, you're big into fight, flight sim as well, are you? Good man. Yeah, the... Uh, once you get bitten by the bug, it's really hard to... Uh, it's really hard to not play it quite a lot. All right, what's happening here? He decided he didn't want to fill up from him. Hello, Rusty. How are you doing? We call it 85. The only way to keep pipes from coming out. Do you know what? I'm actually okay with it now because 
we're away from the headlands or well, away from the edge of the field that was that's my frustration is that you can't uh, um oh don't go in the water don't go in the water ah, that's a good there we go i've been watching aaron i've been watching the warthog project i don't know if you've watched those on youtube it's this guy that's built this super immersive uh, full warthog cop cockpit like custom built it over the last 10 years it's amazing It's not a game, it's a lifestyle. Damn right it is, AJ. There we go. Oh, it's a dream. It's a dream, although we should be picking up from the other combine who's pulled into the field and this is going to cause an accident and why is he not stopping? He might be slowing down now, actually. Will he wait? Now we're in convoy mode. Hello, Keith. Uh, yes, healing very well, actually. I am feeling... I am feeling a lot, lot better. Um, certainly the first couple of weeks, it took longer than I wanted it to. I was surprised how much it knocked me for six, but um, this week I felt um, I felt much better, actually. Right, look, that second combine is creeping slightly still. But that's okay, as long as it doesn't run into the back of him. Please don't go in the water. Please don't go in the water. He's working out his way to this... Uh, I think he might have just found it. Yes. There we go. But yeah, no. Um, in regards to the op, it was... Um, I didn't like feeling helpless. Anybody else feel like that sometimes? You like you can't do anything, you can't move about, you can't, like, carry stuff. You can't get up out of a chair easily. So, you know, I'm, I'm, I'm much happier now I'm moving again and, and fit. Yes, yeah, so, I mean, it's, um, the, it's clipping through, the, the grain is clipping through the tarp. Yeah, you know what it's like, Legion. It's, it's it's frustrating more than anything, because you know you're capable of doing it. But uh, but at the same time, it's you've got to give your body time to recover, right? So, and I just I just underestimated how big and not how it doesn't sound like a big op, but actually, my doctor explained how much stuff they have to move out of the way to get to your gallbladder. Like you, they're pushing you, and they inflate your stomach with air so they can get more space in and stuff like. That. And it's you're like, geez. It's like, and if you remember that the inside of your body is not where anything should be in there, so yeah. But we're back, we're back, we're back. We're fighting fit. I've got another. Um, I've got the rest of this week and all next week off work still, signed off by the doctor, so that's good. And uh, and then yeah, back to life, back to reality. Niltus, I am doing well, my friend. How are you? Look at that, called straight to the Combine. This is the only issue, with a second, we could run these Combines, uh, couldn't we, if we had a second Orgo Wagon. It'd stagger them a bit more. And in an ideal world, you'd be unloading your first Combine before your second one as well. Ooh, Legion. So, at right, like... Not going into too much detail for you all. I had that problem as well. That I couldn't go to the bathroom um, because it's amazing how much of your tum your stomach muscles and your abs control how all of that stuff works. So it just all shut down. Better out than in, the right team. And when you've got problems with it, I mean, the pain I had before. I honestly, at Christmas, I thought I was having a heart attack. Yeah, the boys are back in town. Channel, yeah, this is my my freebies from the show. Thanks to Crone, so uh, I thought I'd uh, thought I'd wear them tonight. Oh, Mrs. FSG's in the house. She's lurking. Better say some nice stuff now, hasn't she? She has been amazing, actually. 
what a trooper because I've been beyond useless and she's never complained once which is great oh Mills you have crones and Oxy how you doing mate Even more than normal. <laughs> yes, even more than normal. Even more than normal. No, she's been brilliant. I'm a lucky man. I am. And she's letting me go to uh, Frankfurt for the weekend to uh, talk about make-believe farming. <laughs> that, that, this is true, Pop Pop. Yes. Need to check her WhatsApp, see what she's been saying to her friends. Well, Rusty's had his... It must be a middle-aged man thing, right? All respect to the wives that put up with us, yeah. Yeah, you've got to be mad to want to hang out with us and not jobs. Right. He's just doing his thing. Oh, look, I'll turn my light off. What a clown. Let's go back to... My combines. Too many bits of kit now. There we go. Once again, we love a bit of Dusty Lands. To this day, you can't eat spicy foods anymore. Is that right, T-Man? Yeah, Scott. She, uh, I got a slap. Well, not a slap. Not a, a, a metaphorical slap for leaving it in. She was like, don't put my, don't put my voice in. But I, I did. I'll try to convince her to do more. She won't go in front of the camera, but she might, uh, might do voiceovers. Musketeer, does the dust uh, mod take into account the wind strength? Unfortunately not. No, that's a limitation of... Although, um, it doesn't show off so well here. Args did a great, um demo of it this morning when you stop uh, certainly when you're doing cultivating when you're throwing up a lot of um like dark brown dust from cultivating when you stop it drifts towards the tractor and the cab which is a really nice uh which is a really nice finish but there we go sorry i haven't been checking stuff it's so funny, like, I'll be really honest with you, it's so funny. <laughs> oh. Cheers, Args, for ordering my beer for me. Strange, strange state of affairs when uh, somebody in New Zealand orders me a beer in my own house. Love it. Cheers, everyone. P Wednesday. When you turn, yeah, there's, there, there is some, uh, there is some, I think, probably game-related limitations as much as, uh, as much as anything else. But, uh, you know, it's this, so this, and if you haven't seen it either, um, the, the exhaust mod, has anybody uh, had a look at the video on that? That's, that looks, in the same ilk of this, it's going to just really have a real nice immersion element to it. You're out of beer, but you have a Mountain Dew. Second best thing, team, man. I love Mountain Dew. So, Mountain Dew, you can buy Mountain Dew in the UK, but it's absolute muck. I wouldn't drink it, but Mountain Dew in America is... Probably because you guys have sugar in it. We have fake sugar in all our stuff now. See, go figure, that second Combine's pipe came out and then went in. And now he's saying he's got a full grain tank. And he's just called him here, because he's on 60... Ah, oh, who knows? Seems to be seems to be working, though. Where's the fence going, though? This is when he clatters into the trees, isn't it? Yeah, see, he's missing that second combine. He's come to this one. This is sometimes the thing that happens with the... Why would he unload this one first? Now, nah, now he's worked it out and he's going to turn around. 
Is he? No. No idea. This is when you, yeah, this is running two combines and one or so in an ideal world you'd run, what, two auger wagons, wouldn't you, one on each combine? Is there, is there any better way though, Legacy? <laughs> Banks is gonna send me <laughs> Oh, a little lag there. I think that was a save game. Yeah, auto save. Oh, would you send me some American Mountain Dew? I would love that. Farm Sim Jim, how are you doing? I did see a few other people dropping in. Danny, hello, is that Dust Mode? It's, um, yes, it's called Dusty, Dusty Lands, it's called. We're running it at the middle of, prob well, it's, it, it's, there's three step steps to it. Uh, well, you can turn it off altogether, but uh, the maximum is three. It's, I don't know, scale of, we're running a scale of two at the moment. If you can you can if you want. Let's bump it up to three so you can see the difference. Look at that! It's so good! It's so good! Now what's going to happen? Is he just going to run with him and load up? Ah, I'm cool, whatever happens. There we go, let's turn that off. Look at that! I don't know about you guys, but I've, uh, I've been in fields when you can't see combines because there's so much dust. So he's going to fill this, and that guy's going to be stuck up there doing nothing, isn't he? Oh, combine from the inside. Good call. I think it might be better on a, like a crop like wheat or something. Is that dust mode take FPS? No. Um, Args was testing it this morning, and I'm the same. I, I'm on Green Valley. So my FPS is low because I'm uh, running my settings really high, but uh, Arx had it running at 60 FPS today with on um, Southern Cross Station and it didn't bat an eyelid. Did not bat an eyelid. He's just decided he's going to... Oh, I'm trying to wonder now if I put a second... Uh, Second auger wagon on. Now we've gone up to three, Zach. We're running at max. I think probably combining is one of the ones where you could throw it up. <laughs> this is called um, Hay Fever Simulator. I actually like it. It works with everything. It works with t tractor tires and everything. So if you bump it up to three, look, even the dust on the fence here is... Right, well, let's sit in the fence as it heads back to the uh, 186 at the moment, so we should disappear in a minute. Hopefully we'll go to that other poor stricken combine on the other end of the field. No. So rain affects it as well, Trey, yes. So if it's rained, you get um, a lot less dust. And in the two hours following... Um, the dust amount increases over time. So, uh, so yeah, no, it does. It's clever like that. I think uh, Args, I had to drop out of Args' stream this morning. He was going to try and test it with rain. I don't know if anybody stayed on and watched it or if he did it. Um, no, he's, he's going the full Monty here, isn't he? You completely forgot. <laughs> well, I won't do it on this, but it's maybe one... It's maybe one in the end. Right, it is 10pm. So, shall we do a little... Um, we do a little giveaway? So, rules are... If you have got... The Kubota pack already... Don't fill in a competition. Let somebody who hasn't got it... 
have a chance of winning it. Um, but all you need to do... Let me just check my um, night bot. All you need to do is type in... It doesn't matter if it's lowercase or uppercase. All you need to do is type in win Kubota, all one word, in the chat. Uh, not out yet, T-Man. It is... Uh, it's hopefully due for um, submitting soon, so... That's the dog rattling in and rattling the door. Um, 98%. Win Kubota. There we go, guys. Nicely done. Giveaway. Tickets to carry it back to FarmCon. At the price I paid for the flight, no danger. I'm about 600 quid out of pocket just to go to Frankfurt. Crazy. In fact, it's more than that if you had the hotel on. Oh yeah, look at the dust. Look at the dust being kicked up off the uh, off the trailer. Stops on the grass as well, which is quite nice. <laughs> One. <laughs> oh dear. Right, I'll give you another another couple of minutes, and then. Uh, Top and tail with DJ. <laughs> Save some money. Right, there we go. Dual hopper trailer's working as well. That's nice to see, isn't it? Right, looks like you're all done. I'll give um, one a last minute. I've probably said loads of times, but who makes Dusty Lance? It is um, FSG, Farm Sim Game. So uh, I think actually Ed Bokes just put a link further up. You want to scroll up. The timing was wrong when I came in with Win Kubota's, but uh, Farm Sim Game. Now, here's... Let's see if this is going to crash into each other. Or is that going to wait there now until it comes back? Because it's not been fully emptied. I'm definitely feeling like I need to have a second orgo wagon running. Um, yeah, we're going to need a second orgo wagon, aren't we? Although that wouldn't have solved the problem because... Um, there's no trailer to unload. That's a good point, Ed. Yes. Good call. Right. Let's roll this, shall we? Let's see. Keep an eye on the chat, and we'll see who's won it. I will make a note of it. You'll need to give me a shout on Discord later, and I will share the bits with you. Right. There we go. Serif Sen. Congratulations, buddy. You have won yourself a copy of the Kubota DLC. Bumps up game, you're late to the party, mate. But we're going to do another one, so it's alright. Uh, Jonathan Kenwood. Uh, I am feeling a lot better, thank you, my friend. It took, uh, took a couple of weeks, but I am feeling, yeah, loads better. So, Seraph Sen, if you can join the Discord, if you're not in the Discord already... Uh, the link is in the description. Join the Discord. In fact, if you put exclamation mark Discord, you'll get it here as well. Uh, I will send you a copy. Uh, drop me a drop me a private message in Discord, and we'll um, we'll get you sorted out with a copy. Congratulations! Right, are you going to go to that second tray, uh, that first combine, or are you going to just hang out with this second combine full time now? Oh, 
It's just doing a little bit of a dance. And there you go. For who was asking... Um, oh, Pop Pop. There you go. There's a link to uh, Farm Sim Games' Facebook page as well. There we go. So you know what's going to happen now. Combine doing the headlands is going to crash into Combine doing the lands. That's how it That's how it happens, isn't it? Two all wearings and two trucks to keep them running. Yeah, kind of. I was kind of hoping... We would get a bit of a rhythm, but I think you're right. Yeah, and I think um, we need a second auger wagon, really. Yeah, the <laughs> they are. It does not affect dirt on input. Yes, it doesn't... No, it's not linked to how dirty your vehicle gets. Well, we're going to do another giveaway at the end of the stream, T-Man, so... Uh, maybe you'll lock in then, mate. I think it feels too warm Do you think, Quantum? We're in Nebraska as well. You saw the amount of snow that was here in the winter. Don't imagine it gets this dusty up here. Maybe it does. Oh look, the truck is back as well. Now, the moment of truth is this. Has he emptied both of his um, hoppers? Or has he done that thing where he only empties one? Both of them are empty. Look at that. Now that is exciting. Take care, Mally. Thanks for hanging out. Um, yeah, dirty links. They usually come around about this time. Uh, farm Sim Jim. So what I would want to do is probably have two weight points if I put a second auger wagon on and run uh, independently run an auger wagon for each combine. Although I now think the gap between the two combines is maybe enough that we... Of course, look. I mean, you couldn't make it up, could you? You couldn't make it up. Please go past him. No, 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 no. What are you doing? What are you doing? Oh, no. <laughs> oh dear it's almost brilliant isn't it and then it just goes a little bit wrong right we should be good now we should be good now if it was a multiplayer you're right you're right Jan you would You'd be able to manage it. It's just the little little automation stuff, isn't it? Well, maybe we maybe we knock off auto drive for the uh, auger wagon, and we run it ourselves. Maybe we do that for a bit of fun. Yeah, he's full already. So let's catch a lift off this guy. There we go. Well, we proved it worked. Other than uh, just those little AI challenges we have a bit of in cabbing shall we oh we haven't folded that down either oh he's off is he Yep.
too far over. Try and set my uh, cruise control up so I can run at combine speed. I do too many things at once. I'm, I'm multitasking. You know what blokes can't do? Multitask. 10, 9, 8. Let's try 8 miles an hour, shall we? I think 8's too fast. Let's just get out of the cab for a second. Chase Perry, what a lovely thing to say. Thank you, mate. That is much appreciated. Oh, it's full now. You are welcome. I am glad... Uh, I'm glad you enjoy it so much. If it helps, um, I have a riot doing it. Love it. Open sunroof, yeah. Let's get the cab full. Why is my... Um, I don't know why my steering wheel's not folded down. I'll try and do that in a minute, too. Chasing combines. Love it. Clang of the pipe there, that was quite good, wasn't it? What could it be a bit closer? Agent Farmer, I am feeling great, mate. I am feeling really good. Elite Farmer, how are you, buddy? Nice to see you. Nice to see you. We're busy tonight. We're a big, a big crowd in. It's amazing what putting a uh, putting a combine on the uh, thumbnail does for a does for an audience. <laughs> how do I let my steering wheel? I don't know, T man. This is a something I've come across with custom stuff before. There will be a. There will be a thing for it. It will be something like control. Oh, that's the back window. That's the door. That's interesting. They're operated by uh, the mouse. Anyway, we'll work it out. Swamland Willy, which mod's that, mate? Jump out and jump back in. Sometimes it does it auto. Yeah, there you go. Don't know why that did that. Wonder was because we were tabbing in and out of it. Ah, scooter. How are you doing, mate? Oh, he's full over there. A lot of love for your uh, mower mod scooter, and rightly so. Really nice. Really liking the Kubota, uh, Kubota M6. The, I, I have to say, the Kubota tractors are impressive. They really are. Oh, Dusty Lands. Um, yes, it's not out yet, Swampland. Um, Farm Sim Game are the guys you want to be uh, following on Facebook. They kindly sent me a, uh, a copy to test and do a little bit of a showcase on. Um... was beautifully lined up. Jeez. Somebody go and get Onyx. He's a better driver than me. And he's like 11 years old. There we go. Let's knock it back at a mile an hour. There we go. If we can get to the other combine before he runs out now. This is this is how it's going. 
I don't think it'll be too long, uh, to be honest, uh, Willie. It's, um... It's running faultlessly, to be honest. Running really well. I'm running this at th the scale of three, and it looks great. Corn is your favourite... Do you know what? I think I quite like uh, cereal crops. I like a wheat or a barley, if I'm being honest. Only because you can get better screenshots, because the corn's too high. I don't know why anybody else... We used to grow a lot of maize for cattle feed on our farm. And we uh, we never let it grow this high because the wind would damage it too much. He would my my dad would keep it low, lesser lower height than this. Sorghum. Kubota best DLC yet. I think. Do you know what? Um. I'm going to say that I'm going to be slightly controversial here. It's it's the best one, but it's the one I would expect. I would expect every DLC to be like that. Um, the Antonio Carrera pack is good in terms of there's a lot of stuff in it. And again, they did that thing where they, they give us a load of tractors, but no implements. So, you know, if you remove the fact that Iconics has released us a a really nice pack of Kubota branded kit we'd just all be hairing around in tractors again right and we'd be like well wouldn't it be nice to get some branded kits but they're now not all difficult with Antonio Carrera pack because they don't make implements but um, that that's a bonus yeah and I like I like the fact they did that um, I like the fact that I did that with Iconic, that the two were tied in together. I've obviously done a bit of work there to to link the two up a bit, which is good. Um, and I'd like to see that again in the future, if they can do that with different modders. Um, but yeah, it's quite punchy, wasn't it? But then again, you know, especially you modder guys, you know how much work goes into one tractor. So to do, what, four tractors... Two ATVs, two skid steers, and a and a wheel loader. That's that's a lot of time. You're paying mod a few paying devs or modders to to build those. That's a lot of man hours to do those and do them well. Hey, what were we saying? We would be able to keep up with two combines with one uh, auger wagon. Struggling, yeah. Is that right, Farm Sim Game? So who's that? Me and Args. DJ's got it. Who else? Elite. Anyway, we are incredibly grateful. Thank you. I absolutely love it. It's one of my favourite mods already. It's just going to be default, always switched on. Ah, uh, Legion. Um, it's always going to be default switched on in my game, I think. There's, well, there's just certain mods. Um, like the real dirt mods, they're just always on because they make such a difference to that authenticity of gameplay. And this is another one that does it. And it just, it's seamless. It just doesn't even... Uh, just doesn't bat an eyelid it just fits in with the game so good so i mean hats off to you guys for for doing it love it love it love it love it a lot of money changed hands so you could get a copy arcs right i'm full and i'm stuck Pop out the end of this row behind him. I'd rather do a bean harvest any day of the week. That, yeah, volume of corn is the problem. Oh yeah, I think so maybe soybeans is one of my favourite crops to to harvest actually. There we go, he's out. Watch him turn in front of us now.
Right, it's a race. I really need to change. Somebody said to me before, have I changed my setup? And the quick answer is yes, I have. Um, but I need to change it again because I'm not quite happy with it. Grow, oh, Esab does love grass, doesn't he? Farmer Tech, take care, man. Thanks for hanging about. Good to see you. Beans can be very dusty, yes. You know, we're not going to get fully unloaded here, are we? Kubota own Cavernal and Great Plain? Yes, that's right. Yeah, it's legit. And shame on you, Args, for Googling something. You're supposed to come in here and ask without doing any of your own research first. Foldable boy, I do indeed, yes. Thanks to the Farm Sim Game guys who've kindly uh, given me a copy to show you guys. And I love it. Don't set Esab off. I, I, I thought grass would be something that Esab would enjoy, but no. Apparently not. He just likes ploughing stuff. Ugh. Args. Just made all these people wait another week. Hello, A. No, this map won't come to console. It's um, it's far too big, and processor intensive. It would, uh, well, maybe not. Um, maybe not the new generation of consoles. It probably would be okay on those but uh, the old gen consoles would um, melt into a puddle of plastic and metal I think who's nearly full who's nearly full who's going first do we think I, think I might just wait Has he? Cranky, is it good? I haven't set it up yet. You're excited for... Uh, St Stone Valley's out, Willy. Stone Valley came out. There's a few, a few bugs in it, which I think they're waiting to fix. Ah, he's... Look at that dust. It's so good. It is so good. And then you go and cab. Look at that. It is so good. That would be amazing if you could get it onto console. And I'm guessing... Are you, are you, I assume you're using scripts for it now, but it's it's just an extension, really, to the... Uh, the dust particle system, isn't it? Oh, it will indeed, won't it? <laughs> if you're just People are literally sneezing. Honestly, it's brilliant. It's, br it's like... This is the first time I've used it and really used it in anger. Obviously, I did the video demoing it. But just to have two combines running in the dust. I, I, <laughs> Arx is just going to plough everything back up so that we can... Uh, just so we can, we can use this. I am looking forward to trying it out on uh, No Man's Land this week, actually. Still don't know which combine's the fullest. Oh, in fact, the other one is. I'll both get to the end of the row, though. And it's the fact, look, it's the fact it switches off and just goes to tyre dirt when you're out of the crops as well. Yeah, actually, combine... Whatever combine that is. Combine 1 should be ahead of combine 2. But it's working. Oh, I'm sorry, I can't see your name. Ganja Glutton, would I recommend PC over console? 
One million percent. No dislike to console gamers, but the, the, the mods you have available to you on a PC compared to a console are... Um, heaps better. Um, heaps better. So yeah, no, if you, if you can afford it, and I know not everybody can, and it doesn't change the outcome of the game, um, having it on console, you can still have a whole heap of fun on console. But I would always advocate um, PC farm sim if you uh, if you have access to one. It is um, just a more complete game, I think. Thank you, our one. Thanks to our wonderful modding computer. Modding community, even. That's a, so that was one thing I was going to say to you guys, uh, Farm Sim Game guys. Um, it doesn't work with sprayers. Now, what, could it could could it work with sprayers in the future? Could there be a, um, a subtle kind of, or maybe it was just a sprayer. Maybe it was just a sprayer that I uh, I tried, because I know it doesn't sometimes work with some of them. And that was another question: is do you, is a specific do they have to have the kind of particles built into the mod for it to work as well? So if you've not bothered putting a particle mask in on the on your uh, on your mod, it obviously won't work. Does it need something for it to work? That that would intrigue me. As it were with fert lime spreaders, um, Arg's tried it with a limer this morning. It didn't, it didn't kick up much dust either. But again, oh, I'm going too fast. I'm going too fast, or he's full. Right, he's cutting in. Could have timed this perfectly, although I've got 70% in here, so I'm not going to be able to unload him. Yeah, lime is good, actually. Might look at it in the future. Nice. This is the problem, isn't it? You can <laughs> if, you, if you tried to do everything, you'd never get it released, because it would be, oh, we could do this as well, we could do this and this and this and this. You've got to find a point at which you go, this is good. This is good for now, we'll do this. Ah, he's waiting now, at least that's good. I've got my, uh... That's, that's the only problem, Ganja, yeah, it's, uh... It's a little less cost-effective. Although I still have this argument, I'm cracky. The price of the games at PS5 is absolutely ridiculous. There we go. We'll just keep going backwards here. And again, through this field now, we've uh, opened it up. Oh, I wouldn't change anything with this. It's absolutely tremendous. I might uh, get one of those Luskvana, um Motocross bikes. I bet they look good with it on three as well. Hey, when will Elk Mountain come to console? Have uh, I'm not sure. I don't know. I know we talked about it earlier on about doing something, but um, since then he's gone quite quiet on it. So I am not sure. Yeah. So it needs particles. So you need to have implemented particles on your mod for it to work, right? So there you go. Stone pickers it doesn't work with. But you're kind of running at such a so slow speed that that's uh, that's not a surprise. I want to follow this truck back. This truck loop, uh, loop has worked a treat, will it? Well, 
Will Elk Mountain be made a 2x for console? I doubt it. I think it will be a quarter of the size of the Elk Mountain map for uh, the PC. Dust Mod and the new Monster Truck could be good as well. I actually... I kind of roll my eyes sometimes at those gi gimmicky mods, but that is really nicely made. Really nicely made. Do you have any tips for using multiple harvesters, and do you think having auto-drive and course play is necessary? Not necessary. Um... It's, it's probably is necessary if you want to run multiple combines, but it's 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 not necessary for um, to to run the game if you just want to do simple stuff. Um, I think uh, course play really comes it to into its own with multiple multiple vehicles on a field. I'm not sure the AI workers would uh, cope very well with two combines. I think it would uh, would fall apart quite quickly. William O'Sullivan, good morning from Oz. How are you, mate? Nice to see you. Are we having an accident here, or are we just having a little waltz? I'm going to come up and finish this bit here. Oh yeah, no, here they come. I'm finishing off this last land. Well, I might as well not drive all the way down there to meet them. So this running on um, 3x for scale, I think, is bang on for a dusty a dusty harvest. I think I, th 3x might be too much for... Um, how do I adjust the effect? So, Elite, look, you can actually... It's a perfect time, actually, as the combine comes past. So I just press the Shift and Comma key... And watch the wheel. Watch the dirt behind the wheels. There you go. Down to virtually nothing. That's at one. In fact, that's one percent. Oh, the timing's maybe a little bit bad because I'm. And that's it. Back up to three. You know what? I'll do it again when we're, when we're in the crop. You get a better idea of it. But it's just two buttons: shift and um, the comma and period or full stop key is all you need, so... So we're running on three at the moment. Is it looking bad on stream? So there you go, there's three. Let's knock it down to... I think that's about one, isn't it? Oh, that's 1.5 still. The so one. So they... The guy said they think that... Somewhere around about that is what the base game is... So one is anything between 10% and double. That is two. I think the optimal range for me is anywhere between two and three. I think you could tweak it depending on what uh, what job you do. And obviously combining, you have to do when things are bone dry. Um, let's knock it down to two for a bit, shall we? It does, it's uh, universal. So if you've got it set for two, it'll run two across all of your vehicles. Two is two's nice. You've got the nice balance between being able to see your machinery and uh, it's still looking really authentic. And I love the fact it comes off the header as well. It's not just coming out of the back. Because that, that's how it happens, right? I think FS with do ground dynamic ground once they've been off old gen. Maybe. Maybe it would be nice if they did. I think there's probably a, a bigger ask on the uh, the game engine. But it would be nice if they did, wouldn't it? It would be a pretty substantial update to the engine though, I think, to be able to implement that. But never say never. Tiny little strip, typical there. Eh? Drive all the way down the field to fill that up. Lost in the hopper effect. I don't think it is, although there is. Maybe it is. I don't think so, actually.
Oh, no. That would have been good, wouldn't it? What setting determined? That will be your... That'll just be your view distance settings, I think, pop, pop in your game. So if you've got your view distance turned up or turned down, it'll obviously disappear when you... Uh, Wasn't even full. How does it work on snow? Good question, don't know. Snow is not dust. There's actually view distance settings in um, in the graphic settings. Or you could go into your uh, game XML and bump it right up there as well. Yeah, you wouldn't, you wouldn't have dust in, in snow. I know what you mean though, if it was wind, wind sometimes blows snow clouds about, but as, as the guy said, it's it's agnostic of wind at the moment if it's just rained or is raining is it still dusty it reduces down foldable um, and then increases back up in the two hours after the rain has stopped so uh, it's like clever clever stuff right properly impressed Yeah, I run mine at about 400%. I don't know what I'm on at the moment, actually, because I've been tweaking my graphics recently, so... There you go. Actually, quick question, guys. How's my mic been tonight? I, I, I've been doing some tweaks to the settings to see if I could uh, get it sounding a bit better, so hopefully it's sounding all right. I've kind of got no way of testing. If you put your monitor on, it doesn't really work, so... Good. Excellent. Not good enough to sing, though. Wouldn't do that to you. So, around some dust on the pipe when unloading would be nice. So, I think this is where it comes to where they've put particles on the on the mods. I'm guessing if you covered the whole mod in particles, it would. It's obviously emitting out of the header and the and the discharge at the back. But I wonder if it was, uh, if you put that somewhere else as well, Dusty Lands would pick it up. Pipe dust isn't possible, there you go. The master has spoken. This is where you get into the limitations of the game, right? It's like the question I always get asked about, why can't you have the precision farming map on, uh, on your sim dashboards? And I'm like, it's a very different thing. Passing uh, binary code and numbers through, uh, but when you start pulling graphic, real-time graphics through, it uh, that's a total ke different kettle of fish. If it's a particle emitter at pipe, it would be a different story. So there you go. Need somebody to put a, a particle emitter on the end of a pipe and test it, don't they? Deep voice filter. <clears throat> I think I think a lot of people I agree Magnum I think a lot of people are going to run this almost universally just adds another level of realism right Sorry, well, 50k for what? 50k subs and you and Argy sing you lost that loving feeling. Yeah. <laughs> Every single one of my subs needs to go over to Argy's and sub to him. <laughs> yeah, I agree, Pop Pop. 
I was saying before, things like um, Real Dirt mod um, I think the exhaust mod when it comes out is going to be brilliant as well that kind of belching out black smoke under load is going to be a real real nice touch Not sure how your 2060 will handle it. I bet it will do just fine, Keith. One of the things we were saying today, one of the things is it doesn't... It seems to have almost zero impact on... Uh, zero impact on the... Um, on the frame rates. So my only grumble with that auto game save is that little... Um, stutter. There we go. We great turned up on Elk Mountain driving through the gravel roads in the plains. It will be nice, won't it? Yeah, definitely cranky. Come on, you're going to go fit in here? I don't think you are, are you? Up at 21%. Oh, we're getting a bit more out this time. 16%. Yeah, I just want to watch this truck. I've He's been faultless all night, hasn't he? He's not battered an eyelid, so... I should do him the honour of just watching him once, just to see how he's... That's the joy of auto drive when you get it right the first time, isn't it? It will be an FSG mod. It's, oh, it may come to Mod Hub, but it will be PC only. Is that right? That's, that's the plan, isn't it? FSG, you're going to try and get it on approved by Giants and on the Mod Hub. It's faultless because most. <laughs> what are you saying, Ed? Correct, it'll be on my top, yeah. Uh, MP friendly, will each player... So, yes, uh, Jan. So, for example, Args and I are going to test it on No Man's Like the Weekends, but if Argsy has it set to 1 and I have it set to 3, that's what you'll see. Argsy's dust at 1% and... Uh, and my dust at 3. You won't see me for dust. Look at that. The bit that I didn't do works perfectly. Bomada, how are you doing? Danny, you like that Kenworth? Just good truck, this, isn't it? Very nice truck. If you haven't got it, it's from Carver, and you can get it from Farm Sim Mods and Links. Yes, multiplayer friendly, very much multiplayer friendly. FSG is bang on, each player sees his or her own setting. See, I did read the notes. <laughs> Eat my dust bingo. Did I mod the capacity of the Timpty? Um, I don't think I did. Did anybody see what capacity that was? I may have bumped it a little bit. I think I might have put it up to 60k rather than... This is the 52-footer, though. Um, let me have a look. I think I might have just rounded it up a little bit. Um. No, 44,000 litres. No, no, I've, it's, it's standard, I think. I thought I had, actually. I haven't. Should have. Would have fitted more in. Feel a no man's <laughs> racing hood. Right. Let's see if I can jump back without. I'm going to hand through. Oh, I've got a full combine, knew I would. Of course, it's going to be the last vehicle I get to, isn't it?
Where's that other combine? Right at the other end of the field, typical. There he is. It was turbo mode. Probably changed it, but didn't update the score store description. I think it the store description doesn't show you literage. Does it? Oh, maybe. Yeah, well, there you go. 70. Yeah, maybe bumped it to 70. Take care, Keith. Thanks for hanging out, mate. Well, there you go. I, have, I probably have bumped it. Well, let's work it out. It takes two, uh, almost two, two Demcos. And these have got 44, 45,000. So, yes. I think I've bumped it to 70 and haven't updated the store. 44 seemed low anyway. I decided that. Ah, there you go, Professor. Yeah, it's always... Always pays to have the latest version. I tend to... 78k. Not very realistic. <laughs> Shh. Look at the dust! Deflection tactic. Look at the dust! <laughs> oh, Dan. Honestly, course play is... I mean, both Courseplay and Autodrive are brilliant, but Courseplay does some phenomenally clever stuff. Exactly, Mark. There you go. Totally believable. You did find out your Courseplay button not being on autosave. Need to update the Autodrive new version. Yeah. No worries, no. I'll always try and help where I can. Can't guarantee you'll get a Sane answer out of me, but uh, oh, oof. oh, it's like the end of Obi Wan Kenobi there. Where is the best place to download course? If you Google course play FS22, you need to get it from their GitHub page the only place I would recommend getting. Although I did see it was on the test list for uh, I did see it was on the test list for um, the Mod Hub this week. That's always a few uh, few iterations behind the PC version, or the latest version on the GitHub. Yeah, both AutoDrive and CoursePlay I would only ever download from GitHub. Don't get them from anywhere else. Uh, Twisted, how's it going, mate? Nice to see you. What's happening with you, bud? Only two? Come on, Args. Yeah, you're getting it direct from the developers if you go to GitHub. Failed for translation since <laughs> in there is not a surprise. I think they don't even test some mods, I think they just email them back with not German translations. XX, no! Hello, how are you doing? Yeah, I'm doing well, mate. I am doing very well, thank you very much. 98, 99... Come on. In fact, that I know that hopper's empty, so... We will let him go. Right, we are definitely going to get this field done. He says, as he looks at the clock, and it's ten minutes till the end of the stream. Maybe we're not going to get this done. Oh well, we can come back next week. Like I said, viewership goes up if you stick a combine in your thumbnail. It's nice to have so many of you here tonight. I appreciate you. And I'm kind of pleased that my course play auto drive fun didn't completely fall over. 
like it has done in previous episodes. <laughs> There we go. Fair soldier, you need to buy an Xbox again. Have you not got? Have you not? Have you, have you not got a PC? This is we're running this on PC, so some of these mods that you see in here you wouldn't get on Xbox, unfortunately. Nice one, Dan. See if you can download it onto your real tractors. Dusty Lance has bumped it up. I've been pestering Mark Thor to do a TW 15 25 35 pack. I'm not sure he's bitten yet. I'll keep trying. There are tractors of my youth. You have games and a controller already. Ah, I got you. Still good on a still good on console. Sean McKee. I'm gonna ask you what map do you think I'm playing on? There's a there's a really obvious dead giveaway right in front of you. Yeah, Mark's, Mark's class combine is brilliant. FSG Fenton or John Deere. Um, bit of everything, to be honest, foldable. Uh, I, I like them both. I don't know, yeah. No, I, I can't. I couldn't, I couldn't choose between. Couldn't choose between them. You're a control player. A lot of people are control players. Don't worry about that. Ox is a control player. DJ Goham's a control player. I use a controller for doing my uh, cinematic shots. Get some quite nice, um, nice feel through the joysticks on the steering for controls. You on a wheel still use control. <laughs> It's um, yeah, it's a, a wheel is a wheel. It's good from a from an immersion point of view, but uh, it's a pain in the backside. Guess in the way if you if you you're only PC, you've got to reach around the steering wheel to to use the keyboard, and if you use your computer for other stuff, it becomes quite frustrating. There's one of my biggest frustrations was like trying to edit videos, reaching around a steering wheel while you were doing it, it was a pain. So there we go. Take care, Luke. Thanks for hanging out, mate. Much appreciated. Jeez, oh, Professor, that was a that's a chore and a half. Good for you. Good for you. Dusty. <laughs> Yo, I'm just gonna unload this now. I think I've emptied both combines there. Right, we're getting close, guys. We are getting close. Have I unloaded a load of stuff over the back of that? Or was it just a little glitch there? Really need to change my setup so I can get my uh, sim dash fired back up. There we go. No, uh, Willy. You'll see on the right-hand side there's a column, and in there it'll say releases. Click on releases, 
Um, and that will give you the last kind of build. And then you will see... Uh, and you will see the latest version there. It's just a zip. Oh. oh, I thought I was short then, but I'm not. That's good. Uh, what's Sim Dashboard? Um, Musketeer, just go and um, search on my channel for Sim Dashboard. I've got... Crikey, I must have... I must have 10 or 15 vids on Sim Dashboard now. Um, basically, it's a, you can run a... So, in fact, if I do... See that screen there? See that fence screen? Um... I've created that in an uh, f that runs off Sim Dashboard on an Android tablet, and it's all touch screen. Um, so you've got this like really nice immersive touch screen interface that runs your tractor. So all your key commands, so like unhitching and raising and lowering your tools and uh, turning your implements on and off, turning GPS on and off, things like that, are all done through this touch screen on your on your um, on your tablet. Fun. I've been meaning to do another screen for ages, actually. I meaning to do a class screens, actually, for these combines. This is my next project. Ah, oh, we've got some more converts. We've got some more converts. The fence screen, in, in my view, the fence screen is the best one I've done. It's the most complete one. Hey, we're keeping up with these now. Now we're on top of it, we're doing well. Yeah, it's a good point, Ox. And actually, I think the class screens are quite nice looking ones. Sometimes my frustration is you look at the actual in-game, the, the actual real-life console screens, and they're... I don't know who's designed them, but they're not... Uh, they're not UX designers. Or UI designs, at least. Have I realised how much quicker the camera changes? I hadn't, Cranks, but I have now. They finally fixed that stupid lag thing. That was... That was... I, I think I've probably driven in tractors less inside, in cab, less in 22 than I did the whole of 19, just because of that stupid... Um, stupid bug. I haven't checked out the Massey screens, actually, Zach. Massey's not a tractor I drive a lot. Gotta say. For no, I have no reason to not want to drive them. There we go. Might as well show you the DOS if I'm running the mod. Do I have a course player how-to on my channel? Um, no, well, I don't for 22, but it's, it, is, it is a little bit different tonight. It's one of the things, again, another thing that's on my list of things to do. Um, I do have a few um, vids where I do the two together. Um, Scroft has got a good course play vid, hasn't he? Maybe worth checking Scroft's vid out. He's a good guy, and he's... Uh, Well, some nice masses at the show at the weekend, actually. You have a, a musketeer. I had that musketeer, and I got rid of it. And just replaced it with a tablet, actually. Um, space on my desk. Um, yeah, just it, it worked better for me. We 
work better for me. I could run two or three different screens off one tab because you can swipe left and right and um, so you could have multiple sets of key binds and things like that. Would I have gone to the show if not into farm sim? Um, maybe scooter because um, uh, because I grew up on a farm it's always nice to go and see stuff so I maybe would have gone and it was fun to take the kids and they got to see some good stuff so uh, so maybe I mean the ticket I got the I got complimentary tickets um, from a friend who was working there but I probably wouldn't have paid for tickets somebody had given me complimentary I would have gone but I don't think I would have paid for tickets probably just for nothing else and I was just off the back of my operation if I hadn't had my op I may have thought about it but I think now having been this year again and rem remembering how great a show it was uh, I'll probably definitely go back again next year Jeff Clarkson have you seen my auto drive tutorial on the channel I've, I've tried to explain it because I, I, I agree on the face of it I was the same when I first had a go at it I um you can't, it's quite daunting but uh, but once you get your head around the logic of it it actually comes together quite easily right yes as I can see you lot impatient bunch I can see <laughs> we will do we will do another Kubota giveaway let me just try and point this tractor in the semblance of the the right direction so I can skip away from the screen for two secs and set up the draw. But same rules apply as last time. We will do another giveaway. Um, hang on a second. You could ignore that. Apologies, Richard Wolf. I hope you win it now. Press the wrong button there. Okay, win Kubota. In fact, you know what? Because I messed that up there. Richard Wolf, you've just won it. But we'll do another one. So, win Kubota again, guys. So, Richard Wolf, apologies for that. You've got the warning. So, officially, it's down in writing. I can't avoid it. Congratulations, <laughs> Richard Wolf. But we'll do it again. So, win Kubota, everyone. We will give away three copies tonight. There you go. So I'll give you a couple of minutes. Win Kubota, all lowercase or uppercase or whatever you want. And we will see who wins. Yeah, I press the wrong button. Richard wins a set of Kubota stuff. That's only fair. You can't get somebody's hopes up like that, right? And then... Uh, That would have been mean. I'm going to uh, get some home tutoring for uh, Args and uh, Scorp. Is that the other Oprah gif? Yep. Ah, thank you, uh, FSG. It's been great to have you hanging out the whole stream as well, actually. Really appreciate it, man. XX, I'm afraid it is only PC. It is a PC code that I can get. Right, I will give you a one more minute. 
And of course, if you don't win this one, Args is giving away one, two. Oh, he said everybody gets Kubota. So just spam Argsy's, uh Discord, asking for your free Kubota pack. He'll sort that out for you. We could almost finish this, couldn't we? Hey, Argsy, there we go. Right, well, there you go. We'll roll twice now. Thank you very much, Arx. That is very kind of you. So, we're giving away our fourth Kubota pack. Right, so what I'm going to do this time is um, all your entries there we can we'll roll twice and we will get two results so we've got um, Richard Richard Wolf and Serif Sen have both won already so far so we're going to roll again now so if you've already entered, don't need to do Win Kubota again, we'll do the roll twice with your entries. So hopefully he's going to stay where he is while we do this. So let me quickly jump over here. We're going to roll it. JD Fan 9 congratulations. Congratulations indeed. You have one. That combine over there is full, I think. Yep. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> That's fate right there, that is. Okay, and we're going to do the final one, a fourth one. Thanks to Argsy. Very kind of you, mate. We'll just get this lined up. Combine kicking. We could almost finish this field, actually. Let's get this started off, and then we'll jump back. Once he's, again, pointing in a sensible direction. Right. Stay there for 30 seconds. Not even 30 seconds. be rude not to be I kind of think the same Zach I th we've, we've cleared this very very quickly actually haven't we right let's do another roll here three two one boom Aaron B congratulations my friend so let me just write these down oh JD fan 09 already has it right so I did say if you've already got it don't try and enter the competition because you're stopping people who already got it taken away. So, we'll roll again. Aaron B, congratulations, my friend. That's awesome. So, uh, jump onto the Discord. And we will... Uh, drop me a drop me a, a DM. And I'll sort you out the codes. Uh, Chris Willoughby, who gives you the Kubota codes, mate? Uh, I, I do, I buy them myself. Yeah, comes out of my own pocket. I tend to... Uh, I think it's only fair i'd make a bit of money from the for the ad revenue from this so we might as well plow it back in and give it back to you guys uh, right let's do let's do a roll again here we go fifth time fifth time lucky for somebody are we ready i'm gonna roll it right now caleb powell congratulations my friend Hope you're still on here. Congratulations, guys. Like I said, um, jump in the Discord. Drop me a, a DM in the Discord. 
I'll need to just verify who you are, so make sure your name is the same in Discord as uh, as it is uh, in YouTube. And uh, we'll get you sorted out. Nice one, guys. Four DLCs given away. That is nice, isn't it? I did say this is a Kubota free zone, and we haven't seen any, though, have we? We've not seen any orange. We've just, uh... We've just talked about it. Pop, pop, take care, my friend. Thanks for hanging out, mate. It's been fun. Oh, Zach. Okay, goodwill, mate. Yeah, do that. I'm a bit behind. Apologies. No worries, Dean. No worries at all. <laughs> no worries for FSG. No worries. I'm back. Had to go back in work. Make pr yeah, we've made a bit more progress than we thought. We'd started off slow, but we've uh, it's really kicked in now. Just going to batter through the crops now. That's how little I care. It's not true. It is a cracking pack. It really is. Um, and make sure you download Iconic's um, equipment pack with it as well. You could literally, you could literally run an entire game with it. End to end. I wonder if you could, other than combining. Arx, thank you very much for that, mate. Brilliant. We will chat to you soon. Hey, Joe's in the house. What a guy. And look at that. Joe is donating as well. So, shall we do another? Oh, crikey. Right, let's do another. Thanks to Joe. What a gent you are, Joe. What a guy. The Tactical Farmer. How are you doing, buddy? I just followed you on Twitter today. I thought I was already following you, and I... Uh, I wasn't, so I, I hit the follow button. So, okay. Guys, we're doing one more. We're going to give away our fifth Kubota pack of the night. So, win Kubota... All one word. No gaps. Doesn't matter if it's uppercase or lowercase or anything in between. But there you go. Win Kubota. If you haven't got, and this is important, if you haven't got the pack, don't take it off. If you've got a copy already, don't take it off somebody who has not got it yet. Win Kubota. All one word. And we will try it and win you a copy. Doing well, mate. Doing well. Hope you're doing well. Channel seems to be doing well at the moment, so... Pleased to see that. Thank you, Ed. Yeah. Oh, crikey. Do you know what? I might bank these and do a couple more at the weekend or something. I was thinking about doing a stream. I'm only 150 away from... Uh, 150 subs away from 50k, so... Um, right, any more for any more before I hit the button? Before I hit the button... Right, are we ready? Roll it. Ah, oh, who's this character? Mr. Trey Schmidt. <laughs> Congratulations, buddy. Congratulations. Alright, there we go. And thank you, VFS Crofter, you are a gent as well. I will bank that one. And I will uh, make sure that we do a, div a giveaway. 
And we'll make sure we do a giveaway with the other one. Oh, cranky as well. Stop it, guys. Right, there's two more to give away in our next stream, whenever that might be. Like I said, I'll try and do it at the weekend. And Aaron B's just joined as a farm manager as well. Good work, mate. Yeah. And let me just FS Croft. Uh, I'm just writing your names down, guys, so that I know... Oh, where's he going? Oh, that's that... Cr Remember we saw the big line across the field? That's him playing catch-up now. We nearly ran into him. We're nearly finished here. We are going to stay and finish this. We are going to stay and finish this. We might as well now. You guys don't have to stay. I'm just happy playing the game now. I'm just having fun playing the game. Very kind, Cranks. Indeed. All of you, thank you. You are an incredibly generous bunch. Love to see that kind of generosity. Very kind of you. I didn't read your... JD Fen, I beg your pardon. I apologise. Thank you very much for your $2 as well and saying hello. I appreciate that, mate. Much appreciated. You're a... You're a good'un, JD. Well done. Right, there we go. What do we reckon? We've got one, two, I would say three passes there. Maybe another two and a bit there. Let's not clip his uh, header on the way past. Now, have we filled that front hopper? We have, haven't we? So I'm not going to go... I think we'll run off at the end of this. Even if we're not full... You are a gent, Joe. I appreciate it very, very much. I appreciate it. Thank you, Farmer Ed. Oh, you guys are... Hey, you're giving me all the, the warm and fuzzies here. Very generous. DJD, thanks for hanging out, mate. Have a good rest of day, night, morning, whatever. I think you probably middle of the day, early evening now for you guys, is it? Vaz, how are you, mate? Nice to see you. Farm Sim, Casey, I am feeling much better, thank you, mate. Yes, well on the road to recovery. Feeling 100% better. I've got a couple of war wounds to, to show for it as well, which is quite cool. It's always fun freaking the kids out. Well, I honestly didn't think we'd get through this field. And, uh, alright, we are 20 minutes longer than we usually are, but, uh... Scorpion's Edge, I have to donate... Oh, so! I have a hat update. In fact, I would like to ask you guys advice on this. So, old-style net-back trucker hat. Adjustable, right? That is current. That is current sample. Now we're about to do a head reveal here. My supplier can now get me. So the same as the Crone one at the weekend, the Flexi Fit the elastic backed ones, and I think the quality is a bit better on them. So, what do you think? What would your choice be? If I was if I was to finally... Scorpion's rolling his eyes going, just make the damn hats, man. If I was to finally... produce them properly... Which would you prefer? Flexi-fit? Okay, that's interesting. And I've seen them before, and I've never tried them on because I'm like... I've, the, the only time I've tried them is they, uh... 
Uh, they've been a little bit small, and they look, you look like a bit of a cone head, but that one fits like a glove. SJs. Get the flexi fit. I will. Flexi fits. Flexi fits. An FSG hat would look better on you than an. Hey, FSG, you, you're not going to. Um, you're not going to FarmCon, are you? Because if you are, I'd bring you. I'd bring you a sample. I've got. I've got twenty upstairs. I got samples. Not a fan of the mesh backs. Truck are nicer to wear whilst working. You fans of well. I mean, there's no nothing to stop me making both, but it's just interesting. It's just I, I mean, with the greatest respect to Europeans, there's one nation in the world that knows how to wear a baseball cap, and that is you guys in the states. Here we go, I think this might just be us. There we go. Barbados. <laughs> Babados. FSG meets FSG, yeah. Do an interview. Oh, he's picking up that little clip there, is he? There you go. I'm getting a sense that the old flex if it is a popular is a popular choice. That's good. I will make it happen. I get more colour choices as well, and you can stitch in two places, although it costs more to do that, so they look... Crone have put it on the back. They've done that on the front. Um, Caleb, what you'll need to do, mate, is... Um, join my Discord, there's a link in the description there, and just drop me a quick DM. Uh, but I'll, I'll make a note of that as well. What about my website? Yeah, that's... Add it to the list of jobs that I've started that haven't finished cranks. That's where I'll sell them, actually, because I can't sell them through my... The guy, that's the, the company that does my t-shirts and stuff, their caps are awful. I wouldn't... I wouldn't... wouldn't wish that upon you guys. That's why it's taking so long. Um, because I'm... I'm, I'm being, being a complete perfectionist about it, so... I want them to be good hats, caps when they when they're done. Thank you, Rich. Right, I've noted them. I'm gonna have to do a I'm gonna have to do a mega harvest, aren't I? Again, with all Chrome kit as a as a thank you to the crone stand at the Highland Show for giving me some stuff. Right, here we go guys. Last pass, this combine will be done at the end of this pass. And then, we'll run back down and grab the other one. And that is a good job, but well done. Look at that, it's a big field to have done in one night. Just two combines. So actually I've got a, I've got a test run out at the moment. No oh, last plans, but okay. Thanks, <laughs> Thanks Jan. That's very kind of you, mate. That is very kind of you. Um yeah, so I've got a test out at the moment. I have got a person in the States who is receiving a cap. And I have a person in Australia who's receiving a cap. 
so I can work out what the what the shipping costs are. And that'll help me as well. Farming with Dusty Lands is like <laughs> Dusty Lands greatest hits. There we go. Class. Pure class. But he's done. Is he gonna shut down? You're going to grab that tiny little bit of uh, headland there. Yeah, I'm going to I'm going to make him wear it on the stream. That's what I'm going to do. It is going to take that. Oh no, it's not. There we go. Actually, I'm going to move him. He's he's in the he's in the firing line, holding everything up there, isn't he? Impressive stuff, though. I love these combines, I have to say. I, I did say I would send those hats ages ago, but uh, again, I haven't got around to it. I'm a busy man! I have not utilised my month away from work as as well as I could. I was I was more ill than I wanted to be. I feel like I've been cheated. They gave me time off but I couldn't do anything. Didn't think he was that close to being full. Come on. Oh, man. Can't line it up for loving the money. You can relate. I know, Scorp, you can. Vaz, if I had to choose one map, which would it be? Love Realism and American Maps. Renabu will be for sure when it gets until then tough. Um, do you like pre-laid out fields, Vaz, or do you like to be able to create your own stuff? So you want to cut your own fields out and things like that, so... Because my, I would say my two recommendations... Would probably be well. Th let's say three, depending on what sort of machinery size you like. Uh, uh, Middleburg is great. It's a bit. It's a bit frame hungry. Need a chunky machine to run it well. Uh, Green Valley, again, nice big fields, nice big map, lots of productions, lots of variety of choice. Uh, or Elk Mountain, if you want to cut your own fields and and build your own. Uh, Build your own farm from scratch. That uh, that is the one. Oh yeah, totally surround. That's that's the thing that hit me the most was that I can I could deal with the pain, the discomfort was fine, but it was the fact that your body's just like, no, it's eight p.m. Go to bed, and I'm like, I, I like I like staying up till one in the morning and two in the morning, but no, body's like, body says no. So. Robosock, thanks for hanging out, man. Glad you enjoyed the stream. I'm impressed there's still 141 of you here, actually, because we are running a good half an hour over where we should have been. You like all three of them in the New Stone Valley? Yeah, that's the problem, right? Pick one and go for it. You'll know straight, you're playing. If you're playing it and say, pick one, and if you're playing it and you're like, I wish I was playing another map, you know that's not the right one. Yeah, Oxy's new map looks good as well, doesn't it? I was slightly worried there that we were going to... Um... There we go. Combine 2 done. We have done that field. Not bad. I would say probably... I bet it was two hours by the time we got everything set up. Note to self, next time I'm going to uh, 
do the auto drive stuff to start with rather than setting it up on stream although i don't know do you guys like seeing it set up on stream and going through the process because we didn't actually get much farming done in the first half an hour but i think for those folk that like to see how course play and auto drive works sometimes it can be quite good can't it widget how you doing mate recovery's going very well thank you mate Welker, now there's a good... I, I actually, I'm a little bit disappointed Welker's not out for my 50th, because I thought that would be a brilliant, massive harvest. Ah, it's a shame. It's a shame. Maybe, maybe next time, mate. In case something goes wrong. Yeah, thanks, Zach, because that's bound to happen, right? This is going to work out perfectly, actually. Let's just, just, shall we jump in the truck and head the tr head home with the truck? Turn the engine off. That one turned off. Yeah. Course play drivers have the decency to turn their uh, engines off when they're finished. Unlike me, who leaves stuff, uh... It did, it went pretty well tonight, didn't we? Oh, the usual little glitches, the initial, uh... The initial setup thing is is a pain if you've got trees around the edge of your field, but um, once you once you've opened the field up, it ran it ran like clockwork, didn't it? I think it was better to um, better to run the the auger wagon manually though. I think it would have run two if I was doing it on on auto drive, it would have run two uh, two uh, auger wagons. Just ignore the combine in the woods. <laughs> That's why you run two combines, because you just lose one in the in the trees. You've still got another one running. Ah, oh, that's harsh, Mark. But but fair. But fair. All right, here we go. I've not even bothered looking to see how much dry, so we're going to take all this down to the ethanol plant in a future episode as well, so... We're going to have fun, uh... Fun drying all this out. I don't know how much space I've got in this, uh... In this bin setup, actually. Oh, look at that, I'm filling it back up straight away. What a clown. Um, there we go. Dry corn, we have... Just under 400,000. Oh, there we go. We're into 400,000 litres now. Should do some propane as well. We're going to have, what? I don't know, what? Four. It's still ticking up there. Four thirty-nine. Right. You don't need to drive off again now, because you're done. Your work here is done, my friend. We'll just roll you around here for another day. Without scratching the other trailer. There we go. Perfect. Right. Thank you, everyone. That was actually really, really enjoyed that. There's nothing better than a bit of course playing auto drive when it works and everything goes to plan. Dusty Lands is incredible. Can't wait for you guys to get a hold of that. Hopefully it's not too soon. Oh, no, too much longer. Um, and you'll get it soon. Uh, fingers crossed Giants get it passed. And, uh, but stunning work. FSG and crew. Amazing. Can't, can't wait to see what you've got lined up next. That's absolutely brilliant. So uh, thank you. Congratulations to all the winners. Thank you for all the donations as well. You guys are legends. Uh, we'll get your Kubota packs out to you in the next 24 hours. And uh, have a great rest of your week. And we will maybe catch up at the weekend. Let's see how close we can get to 50k. And if we can get to 50k by the weekend, we'll maybe put a special stream together. But for now, from me, thank you very, very much. Have a great rest of your weeks. And I'll see you all again very soon. Take care. Bye for now.